Now this is my second video that I'm making of this anime because I honestly genuinely like it a lot. Now there is a lot of mixed feelings when it comes to MF Ghost. Mostly because people don't like the fact that it's now like official racing versus street racing. But that's besides the point. I don't care about all of that. I personally like the anime 100% not because it's a GR86 and it's similar to my car. Okay, it could be that I have a bit of favoritism, but it's just not only that. First of all, Kanata Katagiri, extremely likable character. I like him a lot. He's super, super cool, very humble. He's just trying to get by. He's just a chill dude. And the people that are around him, even Aiba, who is like his rival, but also his senpai, he's super chill, even though he's hella freaking weird like hella hella weird and you know what there are a crap ton of weird characters in MF, mf ghost man super pdf files if you know what i mean but to be fair iba didn't know if anything he's just really 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 weird but sawatari straight pdf file bro straight drizzy on that outside of that i think considering that the second season started off kind of like them getting into this race the second the second big race and there's i don't even know how many episodes i mean let me let me look from episode 13 to episode 20 has just been a just a race and how entertaining those episodes were it just kept me at the edge of my seat i was like bro i even read it already <laughs> like i already read that portion of mf ghost and just watching it again it's very rare that i would be like oh man I'm, I'm at the edge of my seat and they're just honestly racing i freaking love it most of the time you know you would look at a character and we have been getting certain flashbacks and certain backstories of different characters but i'm like f all that i don't give a frick about all that all i care about is kanata rivington or kanata katagiri and his race with the 86 bro it's oh it's so good but how everything is like slowly coming together for kanata and them trying to soup up the the 86 because he, he doesn't like the suggestion was hey let's get a supra but he's like i don't like that i want i just want to soup up the 86 <laughs> i was like uh my my 86 heart is so happy now i'm not someone who plans on racing or anything i just love my car so just seeing how kanata has so much appreciation and love towards his 86 it's just, it's just nice to see it's nice to see people who appreciate the car but i will say that this anime definitely highlights kind of like how a lot of characters have their own specific individual flaw even kanata right kanata is kind of like like a ditz almost right but then he's just very appreciative you know he's from england going to japan he loves the japanese culture he's half japanese he's just enjoying the culture he's enjoying eating the snacks he's like oh my god this is top tier he's just i feel like he's very he's very gullible to certain situations that he's not able to put two and two together the word is very dense is, is the word i'm going for he's pretty dense in certain situations but phenomenal racer i I think he's just very kind-hearted even like the person that is helping him out ogata ogata is just a, a, a nice guy he's he's just you know he just wants to help kanata has major anxiety in very in various situations but who wouldn't just that that uh, ogata kanata combination is just so freaking great i want that to stay <laughs> i i feel like I feel like almost like a wannabe fan of like whether if it's MF Ghost or Initial D and even me liking my 86, right? I feel like such a fake fan. <laughs> Why do I say that? It's because it's just like I don't I'm going to be completely 1 million percent upfront with you guys. I barely know anything about cars <laughs> if anything i have my friend shout out to shout out to alex uh, aka chinato who you know he helps me take care of my cars he he helps me you know fix it if it needs to be fixed and oil changes and all that he he helps me out a lot a lot <laughs> with that but when it comes to like actually being pretty knowledgeable of all the cars i'm pretty superficial i feel like because i don't really know much besides the name of the car i don't really go too much in depth i just have fun looking at cars that's all even like when i go to hot import nights when they bring me over and stuff it's just i'm just there for fun guys i'm just there to look at the cars and be like whoa whoa what is that <laughs> i feel like i just have on top of that like i just have other interests that i'm more in depth with but i think i think that's okay I think it's okay to just be a fan of just like the car, the series and stuff like MF Ghost. For me personally, I'm having a lot of fun with it. I have so like I talked about it from first season to now. This is my second time talking about MF Ghost. And that first video, people really thought I was going to trash MF Ghost. And they would comment the video before I even spoke about it because my title was just like, this is not initial D. Yes, it's not initial D, but 
I like it in a different way than I liked the initial D. It gives two different vibes. Even though one vibe is different from the other vibe, doesn't make me like the anime any less than the other. But for some people, because you know, some people grew up on initial D, I completely understand how they would feel. And like, it's just, it doesn't give them that same feeling. That goes with a lot of anime fans. And you know, it's something that I've spoken about. I get it. Some people like older anime versus the newer anime. So they say the quality of anime has gone down, this and that. And so I think there's definitely two sides sides of a coin with it when it comes to mf ghost initial d older anime newer anime i think at the end of the day as long as you're enjoying what you're watching it's all that freaking matters and i enjoy mf ghost it's such a fun anime it's so fun that i had to make a second video because <laughs> i just watched episode 20 the conclusion episode i was like bro this was so high so sad Kanata got fourth though sorry spoilers he should have gotten third they should put Nas on that bitch.